Here we are at week three, guys. I'm Dr. Muir here with Wendy, and today we're going to be going over a few things with you. Um, first thing you should be noticing is you should be noticing all sorts of changes going on with your body, physically, emotionally, and mentally. Um, also, you should be seeing things like your belly starting to disappear, which is really cool stuff, and this is just the beginning. We're also going to be going over a few things here in a couple slides about body physiology and how your nervous system actually plays a role in this entire process and how your nervous system has control and correlation with the supplements that you're taking and the foods that you're eating. Another thing we're going to be going over are plateau days. Plateau days are one of the most important things about the program. They're uh, totally normal and they will happen. So we'll have a slide coming up to show you exactly what's going on with that. The most important thing is you have to remember to be persistent. If you're persistent, you'll get it. If you're consistent, you'll keep it. So stay focused, stay on task, do the program. It won't fail you. Absolutely, guys. Stay motivated because your life depends on it. The most important thing, again, to remember is keep up on the program. Do the program. Stay the course until you succeed. It's going to be the easiest, hardest thing that you do. It's really easy because I'm telling you exactly what to do. It's hard because I'm telling you exactly what to do, so don't cheat. You're, you will, you're going to stop your progress by two or three days every single time that you cheat. Don't do it. It's not worth it. You're invested time into this program, energy into this program, and money into this program. Stay the course. Another important thing to pay attention to is your plateau days. Plateau, plateau days usually happen within about two weeks. What that means is two days in a row, your weight hasn't changed at all. On the third day that you wake up and your weight has not changed at all, follow the plateau uh, day, steak day, fish day, whichever one that you want to do. I always recommend that you try both of them throughout the program if you have double plateau days. It's totally normal for your body to react this way. It's not a problem. Your body is just trying to adjust to its new eating patterns. You will succeed. Just keep on it. Review your goals at this time. As you have your challenges as they come up, just review your goals. Remember what you want to look like. Visualize the new you in that bathing suit, playing on the floor with your grandkids, running a marathon, doing whatever it is that you want to do to achieve your goals. Tell yourself you will succeed. Every day look in the mirror and say, I'm going to beat this. I'm going to win. This is transforming your life and setting a new you forever. Don't let anything get in your way. Every day, focus on your goal. Your faith is bigger than your fear. So remember, this is not a fearful thing. This is for you to always, always be true to you and learn how to take care of yourself forever. So when we think about the adjustments and the spinal correction that you've been getting, you might be wondering, you know, how does this play a role in my weight loss. Well, remember guys, when there is stress on your nervous system, your nervous system doesn't function the way it's supposed to. It actually kicks into that sympathetic stress hormone response, which increases your cortisol levels. So do you guys remember cortisol levels actually increases your belly fat. So as you're getting adjusted, that actually reverses that response allows your nervous system to calm down, so now you're able to react to stress and handle it better. So it reduces the stress response, it'll reduce your blood pressure, those nasty cortisol levels. It actually increases serotonin, which serotonin is that happy bubble molecule that you get on the first day after winter when the sun's out and you feel great for no reason at all. That's your serotonin level. So now you're starting to feel a little bit happier with yourself as you're losing this weight and your body's functioning at a higher level. It balances your hormones, improves your digestion, and improves your memory. So remember, guys, you have that innate ability to transform and to heal. That's why we call it our programs Innate Life Programs, because innate, that's your inborn, God-given potential, potential to heal. So your spine and your nervous system, that's what controls all the functions in your body. See, it's as easy as ABC, guys, your attitude, your behavior, and chiropractic. So your attitude sets up what your winning behavior is. But without action, without the actual behaviors, it doesn't matter so much what your attitudes are. So you have to take action and take steps to transform your life. All three of these work together. And that's why we've created the ABCs of Health book. So if you hadn't read this yet or haven't gotten a copy of it, ask us for a copy in the office and we'll get you one, right? So attitude, behavior, chiropractic. Now, week three, we're going through some things, and I just want to tell you about these two guys here. So Bob, in the picture on the left, 
Bob, what he wanted to do was he wanted to be able to run. He wanted to be able to do, you know, 5K, something like that. And he ended up actually losing 50 pounds on our program. Imagine taking 50 pounds off of your body. How much better would you be able to run? You'd be great. So what actually happened is he ran the great race in Pittsburgh, and he was so happy that he was able to do that that he took that picture in the middle of it and sent it to us right immediately after the race because he was so excited that he was finally able to do that. Now the gentleman on the right, his name's Dallas. When he started this program, he was really worried about his blood work, and he just wanted to get healthy for his grandkids because he had them playing around, and he wanted to be around with them for a long time. Um, he ended up losing over 40 pounds on our program, and his blood work, he went back to his doctor. His medical doctor was amazed at the improvements that he made, getting everything back down to normal. So remember, guys, it's not just about your weight. Remember what your goals are. Remember to keep striving towards your goals, because that's what's going to get you through, and that's what's going to help you succeed and continue to succeed year after year after year. Remember, guys, at an eight life, your life depends on it.